reason why a trans woman couldn't be a father. I'm still her father. I'm just a woman and a dad. Hey, what's up, y'all? Welcome back. I haven't checked out these guys in a minute. These are the conservative twins. Um, they've been rocking and rolling lately. Shout out to them. Shout out to these brothers. One day I'm going to meet them, have a conversation with them. Probably wouldn't be a whole bunch of productivity coming from my, uh, my part because um, I'm, I'm, just a, I'm just a joker and a, and a dad and a, and a husband who just want things to get better in this country. That's it. I'm not a political pundit. <laughs> None of that stuff. These guys, they know their stuff, though. All right? So this right here is about a muscular transgender dad on Segway with daughter. I don't know what the heck that means. I, 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 don't, I don't know what it means, but let's, let's see what they're talking about because, um, yeah, this might get crazy. This might get crazy, all right? And warning might have a little bit of language in here that you might not particularly agree with. Yeah, got a new show for y'all. Got a damn, damn good, good show. show. Damn good show. Me and my brothers are firm, belie firm believers that your sexuality, your gender, it can be taught. You can be taught that. Well, yeah. I believe that as well. 1,000 percent. 1,000, 1,000, 1,000 percent. You can be brainwashed. You can be if, born a healthy baby boy. If sexuality can't be talked, there's no such thing as grooming. Yeah. Right? Yeah. That's probably when our kids exposed to that. Kids like, I can be a girl if I want to. And Ma, mama, I transgender. Mama. Yeah, you can teach it. Transgender. And if you don't mama, believe. Mama, transgender. Uh-huh. Yeah. Transgender. I be like, mama. Yeah. Shut up, you irritating the shit out of me. <laughs> anyway, we came across this video. And Keith's on a rag again, sorry. See, everything about these dudes are inappropriate as hell, man. <laughs> they are weird, man. Y'all are damn weirdos. Keith and Kevin, y'all are weird AF. I'm just going to let y'all know that, all right? Y'all was raised, y'all wasn't raised right. Yeah, I said it. Y'all wasn't raised right, man. Y'all are something else. Y'all daggone parents are watching this, and y'all just over there daggone act like you giving your microphone gawk gawk 3,000. Y'all was not raised right. Y'all funny, but y'all wasn't raised right. Sorry to your parents. They tried their best. You know what I mean? But mm, mm. he's on his period. He's menstruating. Anyway, man, this <laughs> video, this is like. This makes my blood boil. This, this this video I'm about to show y'all comes off like satire. Yeah, but it's real. It's infuriating though. It's like it's really sad. No, it's I like, wish I could do more, but I can't. My hands are tied. It's like it's like it's not even real. Reason why a trans woman couldn't be a father. I'm still her father. I'm just a woman and a dad. If my dad had never transitioned, I probably would not have come out. My boobs are a 42 double J. They're all. Okay, first of all, let me tell you something. This right here, and I apologize. No, I, no, I don't. This right here is next level weird. To the point where you got tired. You you got tired of being in your basement um, looking at videos of women, busty women with big old curves and doing whatever you're doing to yourself, messing up socks and messing up towels and messing up tissue and just wasting seed, going completely against the word of God. That's completely against the word of God. But you're doing it so much that you wanted to be them. You wanted to have your own because you couldn't get that which you wanted. I'm certain that this transgender woman is still into women. I, I bet that this daggone person is into women with big breasts, but now that he got his own, he feels like he don't need them as much. Like he took power back. Like that's some type of, it's just ridiculous, man. I don't know how to explain it. We'll talk later if I, if I get any type of good um, um, thoughts. But right now they all discombobulated, scrambled like eggs. Always haters. I'm not dressing this haters. way to blend in. I sometimes wonder if I want to go bigger. If y'all was walking down the street and y'all saying, okay, what do you call them things? Some bikes you're standing on coming down the street. Yeah, what? it is a segue. A segue. You walk down the street, you see a transgender look like she got big old pecs instead of come down on a Segway. You'd be like. <laughs> I mean, I don't like big pecs. You could You could lose a couple letters, you know. I like like A's and B's and C's. 
I like the mosquito bites. Shit turns me on. I don't like that hanging between his legs neither. What? I'm talking about what type of breast I like. Yeah, but you're talking about the breast you like on a man that have them. Uh, am, I, am, am I missing something? And that's Keith that's talking, right? Or is that Kevin? I always get him dis. I don't know. I, I don't know. Man, Jesus. Do you hear what his daughter said? She came. Yeah, she came out. You and his bravery. He was so brave that she came out. Like, oh, if it wasn't for him, like, becoming a trans person, then I wouldn't have come out. Came out. What did she come out as? Well, she said she wouldn't have never came out if it wasn't for her dad. What does that tell you? That tell you that she was fine with being a young lady. But when she saw her dad wanting to become a young lady, he encouraged her to become something that she wasn't naturally born as. So now she wants to be whatever she wants to be because he inspired it. Now, I listen, if you're coming out as gay, homosexual or any of those things, listen, much love to you. I'm not hating on anyone. But this whole situation is just weird AF. I apologize. No, I don't. Yeah, that's what it is. You don't. She's been taught her sexuality, her gender, because her dad's kind of screwed up. <clears throat> and he's pushing her beliefs. It looked like he was in the military, right? Yeah, yeah. He was in the military, had kids. Everything was going great. Everything's going great. <laughs> now he wants to be a bitch. <laughs> you know how when guys get to a certain age and they want to buy a motorcycle, right? Like, okay, all the kids are raised, the bills are paid, you know what I mean? I'm at a comfortable position where I can afford a motorcycle. I'm going to get me a motorcycle. Well, in this case, mm, instead of him getting a motorcycle, he got breasts and said, you know what? I'm going to become what I always wanted to be. And that's a woman. Always wanted to be. Or it's more acceptable now. And I think if I try this, it's not going to be frowned upon. As a matter of fact, people will encourage it. So, yeah, I'm going to go for it. Yeah, that's right. You go for it. You're so brave. And now this dude talking about, now I want to, now I don't, um, I don't know if I want to go bigger. I want bigger breasts than these. These right here, you know, they big, but they not big, big. So now it's about to be a whole thing. It's crazy, man. Well, it's look it's at just... Caitlyn Jenner, man. She was, uh, uh, what, 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 what event she was in? Decathlon? He was the most masculine dude. No, he always had that hair going. That yeah, he didn't. Ass. He looked very feminine it's, when he was doing that damn high jump. Yeah, that that soft ass face. There was <laughs> something going on with him <laughs> from the beginning of time. Beginning of time, Bruce Jenner. Man, this video crazy as hell. <laughs> <clears throat> I mean, don't this come off like satire? I mean, that looks that look like you big press a thousand pounds, man. <laughs> Why you gotta go so big though? Who what? cares? It's your body, your choice, huh? <laughs> But you know what? That I, what I find infuriating you you pushing this on your kid. I don't know if that's a girl or boy. Or... That's a girl. How you know that? She said she came out. Might be a boy. Yeah, I'm tired of getting tricked, man. That's another thing I. Ain't... I don't think I don't think that he's necessarily pushing it on his kid. Honestly, I think it's a mental issue. It's a mental. It's a mental issue, and that issue did not get fixed, so to speak, or dealt with, so to speak, and it ended up washing over to his daughter because of it if if he had the wherewithal to start a family to go to the military to to do all of these things he was trying he was trying at one point but he just said you know what f it i gave up i'm giving up and if you look at all of our lives many of us get to a point where we just give up we're not as active as we used to be we don't eat as healthy as we once did. I mean, I'm not talking about just becoming a transgender. We don't become transgenders, but some of y'all do. And I ain't got no issue with that. Only thing I got an issue with is the grooming part of it. Like if you're trying to recruit other people to do it and other people to do it and other people to do it and more people and more people and more people. The only reason why I care about this is because it's like it's the end of is the end of the world as we know it. it it really is because you're encouraging more and more and more and more people to be something that they're not and when they're not what they were created to be then humanity stops like it's no more making of of children like her his daughter for instance his daughter if she she came out the closet now she's only going to date girls probably or she's going to become a man and date men 
and be one of the you know the the new form of new words because basically that's straight she's still a girl dating a, a boy but um they're not gonna have any children not naturally but their argument usually is well you know there's a bunch of kids up for adoption we can still raise them yeah you can raise them but you can't make them and you know these it's just, it's just gonna stop this is going downhill so I don't know what to say about this, man. It's 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 hilarious, but honestly, it's not. I mean, I can joke about it all day. I can listen to the I can listen to these two gentlemen joke about it too all day long. But it's other than it being funny, it's it's just a little bit more. It's it's weird and it's scary and it's I don't know. But that's just me.